Hi everyone, and welcome to my Grandma Gamers channel. I'm Grandma Mia, and this is my B and E series of breaking and entering into people's Final Fantasy XIV homes. So join my friend Gabby and I, and be our accomplice, and let's go and scope out some amazing homes in the neighborhoods of Final Fantasy XIV. Let's get ready and go. Hey Gabby, you see anything really super easy up here to do? I don't feel like doing a whole lot today. Hmm, see anything? Oh, wait, what is this little green one down here? It says, find noise in the house. What do you mean, find noise in the house? All houses make old, old creaky sounds and all kinds of things like that. So what does it mean by find noise in the house? What do you think, Gobby? Think we can find the noise that they want? Let's see, where's the house? I think it's this house back here, this big one back there. Let's go find the noise, Gobby. What kind of find the noise? <laughs> We've done a lot of things, but find the noise? What kind of noise are they talking about? Who owns this noisy house anyway? It's Nork's Beach House, and it's Norxalia Nasreen. And we're on the Excalibur server in the mist, Ward 18, Plot 2. And it's a Desire in Our Home message book and immersive experience. And it's a noisy house. So come on, everybody. Let's go find the noises in the house. It's a large. I'm giving the overhead first because look at this. Isn't this look so tropical? Very colorful, very tropical. Oh, I like this. Oh, yeah. I like this already. And of course, the Lollafell Jacuzzi. What more can a person ask for? There's th some yummy, delicious snacks here with the cherry blossom tree and the spa with some palm trees and ponds. This is just really super nice. I like this. The lounger with the umbrella. I like that painted yellow. And oh, she's rich. She's planting dirt. <laughs> and the fire pit. I really like this. This is just very tropical looking. Okay, let's go check out and see if we can find the noise, if we can get around the door. Hi there, we're here to uh, find your noise in your house. Okay, another attitude. <laughs> I hear water, but that's right there. Wonder what that mysterious other sound is. We'll have to find out what it is. I like this entry. This is really amazing. Look at this. Alpha's up there. Got the double fish tanks. And I like this fountain. I really do like this fountain. This is really nice. Very pretty. I like the entryway. Oh, I've got a little lag going on. What's over here? There's a seating area. Oh, I like these colors with the blue. Yeah, oh yeah, I really like these colors. Look at this. Another seating area. You could sit up here and read some books. At least we don't have to. Hey, wait, I hear that sound again. There it is. This is really pretty view. The pendant planter lamp or something, lantern or something like that. That sound is just, oh yeah. I'd be wanting somebody to find it too. Hi there, we're looking for the sound. Do you know anything about it? Oh, I guess not. Okay. So let's go over here. Another area to relax in. Got some airships, some paintings like all the windows. Must be able to just sit here around here and hang out with people in this room. Hi there, we're looking for the sound. Okay, you don't, you must not hear it either. Okay, let's go down here to the basement. Oh, another seating area with music, with some instruments. I like how she's got all the angles on the windows. I want to call it beveled, but I know that's not the right word, but I like that. She did it upstairs, now she's doing it down here. Oh, look at it. She's got a library with lofts all the way across. You could go here and get all the, these books and everything. Oh, this is really nice. More angles here. 
I really like this with all the statues. She's got mannequins over here. This is just really pretty with the mannequins. I like the concepts. I like um, what she's done here. <gasps> Gobby! Bling! Oh my gosh. Gobby, fill your backpack. You know where this is going. We haven't been paid in a long time on a lot of jobs. So grab as much as you can. Like the bling. This is an office back here. An office minus the bling. So she took the basement and she made it into thirds. Sectioned it off into thirds. Well, maybe this is a little bit more than a third. Like the double-decker aquariums. I really like how they use the lanterns, the lamp posts here, all the way around instead of, see there's some over there too. They used them throughout this entire house. I really like that. Instead of putting pictures on the walls, that's just, it's that's really unique. <laughs> I really like that. Okay, this is the bedroom. I like orangey colors anyway, so this is really pretty. There's makeup here, Gobby. Let's take the makeup too. I don't hear that sound up here though, Gobby. And there's some stuffy plushies up there that we can take back. I like that painting. And there's the paint palettes we can take back really pretty. I like this room. I like the colors. I like this house in all together. There's a telescope there. I really like how the owner used like every bit of their house. That is just, I like how they did that. That's just really cool. This is just an amazing house. I love this house. Norzala, I love your house. I hope that's how you say your name. I'm sorry if I'm mispronouncing it. Your house is absolutely beautiful. I love the colors. I like what you put together. It's every room has got something in it. It's full. It looks like you've really enjoyed putting your house together. I love it. And Gabby and I thank you both from the bottom of our hearts for all the bling that you donated to us and the 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 farming people. <laughs> I love orange. So the peach color that you're using throughout the house is just absolutely beautiful. So Narzala, thank you once again for inviting us. And as always, everybody, take care. Have fun and be safe out there. Come on, Gabby, let's go find that click, that ticking noise is driving me crazy. See, you can hear it. I think it's this right here, their fountain. Got the shower with the water, but it's two of those clocks put together for the fountain. That is just really pretty. I really like this fountain. It's a great idea, putting these clocks together. I wonder if those clocks are waterproof though. <laughs>